What is going on YouTube? It is RC Games here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to pack a punch and get all the rituals done in Black Ops 3 Shadows of Evil. So first step, what you need to do is go unlock this gate right here, the first gate, main gate, doesn't really matter, 500 points. Um, then you get some XP for it, which is pretty cool too. And I just knife a couple zombies just because. And then what you're going to want to do is go into beast mode. And this stuff that I'm doing right now is not mandatory, but I like to do it, just get out of the way. Just one run, but you need to knock this box right here, so just hit it. Then you're going to come and zap this crane, which is going to drop that box, so you want to do that. Then turn around, zap up, or not zap, um, well, grapple up there. You want to run as fast as you can to get over here, so you can zap the staircase right here, which builds it, which is pretty cool. Right here, and it builds it, and it should pop up right there. So then what you want to do is go grab the spear, and the spear is pretty much for all the rituals which you're going to need, so make sure you get that. And then um, for the first ritual, you're going to need this thing right here. So once you drop the box, it should be here. So just pick it up, and it's going to spawn two gatekeepers um, right there and right there. <clears throat> just knife them. They should go away like that. Um, that's only for round one, though, so don't knife them like round 20 because that will just end up pretty bad. Um, so next, what you want to do, I like to keep at least one zombie, but I think I'll be fine to go do it. So... Let's head up to the ritual spot, which is up here. And then all you're going to want to do is press X on this. And then um, press X again. That's going to begin the ritual. Then you, I just like to train them. You guys can kill them if you want. But um, you get some extra points. Um, but I usually just train them. Just get it over with. Because if you kill them, they respawn. So I don't really want that too much. So keep training them. Just like that. Nothing too bad. And zombies will start coming in twice. You just keep one. So it'll be a little bit easier. So once that's done, it kills all the remaining zombies. These two. So then you want to grab this. And then that your first ritual is done. Okay, for your next ritual, you're going to go on to go to the waterfront. doesn't matter which um, which order you do it in. I just go this way because it's the easier one. So um, so you just open this door. It costs 1000 And then what you want to do is come down here. And then there's going to be another door right here. And you're going to want to open that as well. And then um, for the ritual parts, you need to go into beast mode right here. And then go right here and then grapple right there. And then you're just going to hit this box down. And then you're going to run all the way down here. And there's going to be this door you can just smash. So, so like a melee weapon, just like in multiplayer, just hit it like that. And it should be good. And let's go back into human form. Then we should spawn right back where we were. Then we're going to go pick up that hair piece. And then there's going to be gatekeepers every time you do this. So just make sure you're safe with it. So just kill them easy, just like that. All right, so now we're good. Now let's go do the ritual. So let's head over here. Alright, and after two rituals, there is going to be a Margwa, so be careful. That's why I have this shotgun, just to take him out really quick. So, yeah, we should be good. So, we're going to place this down, and we're going to start this ritual. And this one... Harder just because there's more responders and it's a little bit more tight in here, so I suggest be careful. Um, maybe for you guys to kill them, just kill the um, things that they might respond to, so, so I'm careful with that. Alright, so, I'm just going to train these guys, and then you guys should be on your way to the next ritual. Alright, there we go, ritual's done. Then all these zombies die, then you want to grab this... If you are in single player, just by yourself, you will be able to pick up all four. If you are with others, you can only pick up one. So just keep that in mind while you're doing this. And then you just want to kill this thing, get easy points for the next ritual. And yeah, I'll see you guys back next at the third ritual. Okay, guys, we are back for our third ritual. W ritual, sorry. Uh, Footlit, foot, oh my god, I cannot speak right now. Footlight District, and you're just going to open this door. It's 1,000 points. And then you're going to want to open up another door, which is down this way, and it's going to be right there. That is 1250 points, so yeah, to save us some points, I did it. And then, so you want to go into beast mode. Then I zap this thing right here, just like that. Then you're going to grapple up there, which you can't reach, apparently. So then you're just going to go around here. I zap that. You don't have to. Then you're going to jump over here on top, then hit that box down. And then you're going to come over here, and then you're going to grapple across the way to that place right there. You're going to turn around and zap that. You should be able to do this just in time, so you guys should be good for that. So you're going to pick up the hair piece, two more gate people, whatever. Kill it. And then um, there should be one more. There it is. All right, cool. So now we're going to head over to the other ritual. All right, guys, we're here at the other ritual, the Black Lace Burless Q. I don't even know how to say that. So we're just going to go down here. 
and we're going to head up onto the stage. So we're going to place this down. Hair piece, just like that. Nice. Alright, cool. Now we just got to train them again. And um, then we should be good for our third ritual. We can go on to the last one. Alright, train these ones. Alright, we are done. We can pick up our third gate worm. So we're going to pick it up. There we go. So now we have three done. As you can see, if you guys want to check, just push the select button. You guys can see down there. And then we're going to head over to our last final area for the ritual. And we guys can go and open up Pack-A-Punch. That's going to be cool. So now we are going to go this way. And I'll see you guys at the fourth ritual. Alright guys, we are here at our fourth and final um, ritual, so we're going to go down to the canal district, and this door right here is a thousand points, and then you're going to open up one more door, which is down here, which is right here, and you just open that up, just like that, and then what you want to do is get the beast mode right here, you're going to become the beast, and you're going to zap up there, okay, and then you're going to want to open up this door, where is it at? Oh, it's down there. One more store, story down there. I'm going to zap that. And wait for that to go. I don't think I'll be able to do this in one run, but maybe I can. If I got the power in me. I'm going to zap that. And then, yeah, I can't make it. All right, so let's use this other beast thing right here. And then what you want to do is there's going to be three things down here. You need to zap that thing, which is back, back here. Then if you run over here and turn this way, you can hit that with the melee button, and then you're going to hit that again. Then that's pretty much it. And then you just want to go back to your human form, and then you're just going to run down there, and then there's going to be this part, which is right here. Kill you, which is right here. You're just going to pick it up right there. You got the badge now. Then there's going to be two more of those, um, uh, what's it called? The spawner dudes, whatever, I don't know what their name is, really. The Oh, the gatekeepers. So you want to go over there, do that. And then you're going to want to place the thing up there, but I'm going to finish this round so it's not hard because five, they're runners. So I'm going to finish this round, and then I'll be right back, and we're going to finish the ritual. Be right back. Alright guys, we are back and we are going to finish our fourth and final um, ritual. So what you want to do is come up the staircase you opened. Then you're going to come over here and go up these steps right here. And then you are going to place it down and then begin the ritual. This is the fourth and final one. This is a really tight place. Um, it's probably easier to do this on beginning rounds just because of how many um, tight corners there are. And then, um, yeah, you should be good. Alright, so just keep training them like that and you should be good. All right, pick it up. Nice. There we go. Then it's going to spawn one more Margwa. You have to defeat. And then I have to go up here. Was oh, that max ammo? All right, we're going to come down here. And then we're going to keep those guys right there, though. And what we're going to do. Okay, that scared me. Oh, no, no, no. All right, we're good. We are going to run down here, down these steps. And this isn't the only way you can go, but um, you should be fine going this way too. So what you want to do is just run down here as fast as you can because I'm, ch I'm getting chased. So um, you want to open up the rift. You're going to jump in. All right. 